My name is Dr. Cisco Sanchez Navarro, and today I'm going to talk to you about local liposuction or awake liposuction. So what I decided to do is I was going to bring you back uh, to my procedure room where we do all of our awake uh, local liposuction. So you'd get the opportunity to see what it's going to be like, uh, what the patient goes through to answer some of your questions, uh, and even to see some of the instruments and what the OR looks like, okay? So why don't you come and join me? So who gets local liposuction? So I see a variety of ages. I see patients as young as in their 20s, going up clear into their 70s. And because of the safety factor, I'm able to operate on all these diverse groups. Here we like to use what's called the VASER, with a V, not a laser. You can see the box here, it's the blue machine. And this is the actual uh, instrument that releases the ultrasonic waves. And what it does is it breaks up and emulsifies the fat, kind of turns it into a liquid. But then also what it provides is some skin tightening, which you don't get with traditional liposuction. Traditional liposuction only allows you to liposuction the deep fat. With this, we can even get into the very superficial, the stuff that's really close to the skin, and really bring down all that fat that is uh, collected over time. So when we're done with that, we switch over to one of our suction cans. And as you can see, both the ultrasound device and the suction cannula are very, very, very thin, all right? And the reason is they don't need to be much bigger. So this would be the actual suction device. It would be connecting to uh, wall suction or some sort of suction. You can see some of the canisters right here where we collect the fat. Some people ask uh, how big are the incisions that are incorporated in liposuction. We say they're about a centimeter in size. They go on to heal beautifully. Uh, looks like nothing was ever really there. So happy with my results so far. Love Dr. Cisco. Love the whole team. Just really, really pleased, and I'm so glad that I um, I did all my research and decided on this um, this clinic being the one that I decided to go with. Well, one of the best parts about doing a wake liposuction is that I can rotate and move you at will throughout the case. This is important because it allows me to tackle areas that you wouldn't be able to really tackle effectively if you're doing it under general anesthetic. And then something at the very end that I love doing with my patients is uh, standing them up. So I stand them up out of bed and I assess for symmetry, shape, and contour. You don't get that with general anesthetic. You can't stand a patient up. That's impossible. This is why uh, awake liposuction really sets it apart. And uh, it's my preferred method.